Green Square! Dun 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 dun! Red Circle! Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> Sup guys! <laughs> Welcome back to another Cemetery Mary Street. Am I shaking? doing that? Yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry. Cemetery Mary Street! Yay! <laughs> we went back in time. We time traveled, but it's not us doing it now. It's the game doing it now. Well, we went through all of Reginald's yeah. good route. Yeah. Yeah. We're and then oh. to making sure to also do all the stuff for the true ending. Yes. And we quit pretty much. The only thing that we went into in the true route was that, okay, if we're going to do this, we need to go back a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, so we're going to try to do the true, where we're going to begin the true route, which I don't know what that means, but I'm excited to find out. I don't know if today will be the last episode or if we'll get one more out of it. I'm not sure how long it's going to be, but I don't know. <laughs> it's going to be fun. Here we go. Let's get into it. I think it's under slowed. But, uh, is it this one? It should be okay. the last one that you... Yep. Okay, let's say history just real quick. What, where did we... So, it, the game made us time travel back. Yeah. To well, because we did the whole, you know, he kidnaps us. Mm -hmm. But then she was like, wait, that's not how it happened. Yeah, so here we go. It says, let's rewind a little bit, shall we? It's been a few days since then. I've uh, felt a lot closer to... What? To... Streams. Is it slow? It's zero. Our internet sucks. Out. Sorry. I don't know why. But it's been really funky these past few days. Um. Well, maybe I should have restarted the wire router before we I mean nothing we can do now <laughs> uh I felt a lot closer to Reggie since our day at the aquarium although he's been so busy with work I haven't been able to see him since I it don't feel good. lonely he sent me text. yeah so normally after the aquarium either Twyla gets killed <laughs> Or, what's the good route? Why are we with Reginald on the good Sheesh. route? It's so far behind. That's okay. Um, like, we haven't even started talking about the internet. <laughs> oh, well. What, I mean, what, what, <laughs> we can't do anything about it. Okay. Hey, red circle! Alright, we're back! Yay! <laughs> Sorry for the technical difficulties, but it's whatever. Yeah. Anyway, back to what we were doing. Uh, the true route of Cemetery Mary. Alright, so, a few days since we talked to Reginald after the aquarium date, but I don't feel lonely. It's nice to be alone, but not lonely. Besides... Uh, I have a nice day by myself, uh, returning to the cemetery, uh, but as soon my head started to hurt again, I felt dizzy and I took a small rest, Reading sitting so down much. by myself. <laughs> what, me? Yeah. I'm refreshing the audience! <laughs> but you're basically going through it all again. <laughs> uh, return. Okay. <clears throat> But that's not what happened, though. I truthfully didn't mean to fall asleep. I didn't. She freaking always falls asleep. Mary has issues. <laughs> when was the last time you fell asleep without meaning to? I can't remember. Probably when I was sick. I think that's the only time it happens. Is if I'm sick. See? You can't even remember, huh? I mean... I have a bad sleep. <laughs> Me too! I have a very hard time relaxing enough to be able to fall asleep. So, I would never be able to do it by accident. Never. Anyway. Uh, but when I 
sat back against the mausoleum. It's the mausoleum again. Something's up with that mausoleum. Um, we have, after being outside and on my feet all day, and having one of those familiar headaches, well, I was just so tired, I didn't even realize I fell asleep until I woke up to the sound of rain. I... So wait, this is like the movie theater scene? I don't know. <laughs> huh. Finally, I can do without hearing myself. Alright. <laughs> I was surprised not to have any strange dreams this time, but this was a big problem. Only the roof... Oh yeah, that makes me... You know, since we did Reginald's route, this is the only route where we can't talk to ghosts. Yeah. You I mean wonder if there's a if difference makes, if we... If we could, or if yeah. we couldn't. I don't know. We could always see. It might give us something else to do. Maybe whatever you want to do. The Only the roof trim of the mausoleum was keeping me safe from the rain. And it was pouring. And worse even still, it was night. The only light I could see was from the street lamps at the outside of the cemetery. Oh dear. How could I have slept so long? Well, I couldn't stay hiding under here all night. I mean, you could. <laughs> Strange going down again. I took a big breath and ran across the cemetery to the street. Luckily, the gate wasn't locked. Again, I was surprised, but thankful, as it meant I wouldn't have to stay, I wouldn't have to find some other way out. Yeah, I walked, once again, I was out on the sidewalk, and I noticed... Ah! Okay! <laughs> the street lights... Well, I'm just... I, I normally don't correct you. It's just... That might be important. Mm. You know, because if I'm this distracted because you theater, keep bringing up the stream, and it's like, ah, I'm getting flustered. It keeps dropping to 23 <laughs> I don't know what's happening. <laughs> The street I mean, lights have they been were the, the um, I have no idea. <laughs> the street lights were the only lights on. Everything else seemed closed. How late was it? I didn't want to pull my phone out in the rain to check, but Oh wait. This is different. Well she said that's not how it happened. The bus! There's the bus! I sprinted to the bus and tried to get the driver to notice me. Even though I was wearing all black, the driver seemed to see me. Was it the bus driver this entire time? A background character you never even thought of. The Did you ever number? think of the bus driver? I, we've never, I don't even know who, what the bus driver looks like. No, she's never talked about the bus driver. The bus driver? I mean,. That would be the person who sees her all the time, considering she takes the bus. If it is a bus driver, my mind's gonna be blown, okay? <laughs> it might not be the bus driver, but if it is. Um, even though I was wearing all black, the bus driver seemed to see me. Oh, well, your Thanks. hair's bright red. Good. <laughs> yeah, and if it's the same bus driver, they do recognize people. Yeah, especially when you take it long enough. Yeah, I'm sure. Mary seems like a very, like, noticeable person with her outfit her hair i don't know this whole town seems to be a little bit goth i guess that's true <laughs> so maybe you wouldn't pay that much attention at least her outfit wise is yeah what I'm to put. yeah <laughs> anyway i mean she always says she dresses weird but like i said it seems like a lot of people dress <laughs> kind of like punkish or something <laughs> yeah. yeah see but the only thing is is uh, I Anyone hope. who dresses casually dresses in some sort of... <laughs> Punk. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm interested to see, though, is this her... The right... This is the right bus, right? Oh. Like, it's not some kind of ghost bus or something? Oh, no. The only <laughs> one way to see. I've heard of scary stories where stuff like that happens. You know, like, you got on the last train, and it's going to a station you've never heard of. I heard a, I heard a story that you wouldn't like. Why? Because it involves a mannequin. Oh, I don't like it. Humanoid things that aren't human are weird. 
But I et, I love Beauty and the Beast. If it looks humanoid, then it's weird. Those guys just look like little candlesticks that have like googly eyes. Okay, we're ruining the immersion. Okay. <laughs> Thank goodness. I apologized a gazillion times as I boarded onto the bus for having to make them stop for me. But I was all so very, very grateful they did. I have no idea how I would have gotten home if I had missed the last bus. Or is this so that she doesn't have to go to Reginald's house and figure out that he's... <laughs> I think so. Or anyone, I guess. Thankfully, the rain didn't last too much longer, or perhaps we just drove out of it? I mean, the only thing when we learned, went to Twyla's house was that she doesn't consider us her friend. <laughs> that was traumatizing for Mary. Uh, either way, it was plenty dry when I got off the bus and onto that old dirt path. This doesn't sound dry by the footsteps. I don't know, I could see it as like sounds a sandy like, dirt. It sounds like wet gravel to me. Um, it was just a bit dark, that's all. That or maybe it's the squishiness of her shoes. Luckily my phone still had enough battery to use its flashlight and help light my way. Even though I'm sure I could walk this path in my sleep by now. Oh. The lights are out. I mean... I guess Crone's gone. Yeah. Crone's out of town. If we this gone. is the night where yeah. she falls asleep, yeah. then yeah, Crone's not in the city. At the I moment. guess. I don't know, I'm getting a bad vibe. <laughs> the house was dark as I approached it. Had I not lived here for weeks, I'd even say it looked scary. Like, haunted. A Wait, like a haunted abandoned cabin in the middle of the woods. It was dark, so either Crone wasn't home or was already sleep asleep. That's right, because she didn't call, so she doesn't know. Yeah. I tried to be quiet as I entered the front door, just in case he really was sleeping. As soon as I entered, I felt a wave of tiredness crash over me. I... I need to sit down. Okay, but like, turn on the lights. <laughs> Don't just sit in darkness. Also, hopefully you changed out of your wet clothes. That too, but mainly darkness, Dustin. <laughs> what, don't want to catch her death? No, okay. <laughs> uh, am I... really so tired? Wet clothes are very dangerous. <laughs> because it doesn't let your body properly... Okay. Boy Scout. <laughs> Evil Scout. Yeah, oh, excuse me. <laughs> um, and after I just slept so long, what's got me feeling like this? I don't know. You've been through a lot emotionally. I feel like that's pretty draining on the body. And you just walked home in wet clothes. That too, you know? <laughs> it's been a long, long few weeks for you. Especially this, like, last week. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's been a lot. Maybe I should go to bed. But I, I have to get out of this chair first. I need to muster the energy first. And she's gone. <laughs> Are we going to wake up? Okay, okay, okay. What do you think's gonna happen? Are we gonna wake up and somebody else is in the house? Or are we gonna have a weird dream? My guess is weird dream. Yeah. I don't know. With the lights off and it being like, oh, I don't want to turn anything on, just in case Crowen's asleep, makes me feel like maybe we're not alone in the house right mm. now. Ugh. Am I still sleeping? It feels like... I'm being pulled. Oh, I don't like it. <laughs> Is somebody picking us up? I wait. I'm. Oh, I just crying. Okay. <laughs> it's, it's just our kind of cousin. Crying. You scared me. Ah, sorry about that. Could you? 
go back to sleep for me? Why? Huh? Why? He's doing something secretive. It'll just, uh... Be easier for me if you are. Wait, okay, wait. <laughs> what, what's happening? Rowan? What are you talking about? Crow inside and stood up properly. Follow me. Please. Crowan walked towards the front door. I could see a faint light out on outside. I followed him. Ooh, big old like oh, Wait, is he he wouldn't be trying to kill us, right? Uh, no. I don't think so either, but what is he doing then? Taking us somewhere? Maybe. Hmm. Is Crow in a spy? Do you have my parents this whole time? <laughs> what if he has my parents? Um, when I exited out the front door, I could see Crow in out in the clearing near the house. There was a large vehicle there that was clearly still running. Crow in? What is this? Mary. I need you to get in the car. Am I being like... Am I being like put into witness protection program or something? Mm -hmm. Oh no, is this... Do you... Is this important? You don't know, huh? I said we got to the end. Everything uh, here is... Why? My icing. first thing is why, right? Don't you think? Even what? though I know you don't like icing. <laughs> I don't like frosting. <laughs> okay. Frosting and icing are different. I don't like either of them, okay? <laughs> Except for on donuts. Whatever that is. It's, uh, that would be more of an icing or a glaze. I like that. Alright. <clears throat> We're not talking about food right now, Dustin. This is serious. <laughs> uh, Why? It, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, it does. It does a lot. I'm not going to get in the car, Crowan, until you tell me. That's not the important part. That or is our family and a family. The mafia? Well, not necessarily a mafia, oh. but, you know, some sort of criminal organization. I don't know. I don't. Well, because remember, Crowan kills people, so. Right, but if he was maybe part of the FBI... Or CIA, then it's like license to kill. <laughs> we just need to leave, okay? Oh. Leave where for how long? We're coming back, right? Um, leave where? I feel like how long doesn't matter, and we're coming back doesn't matter. I don't know. I think to marry it would matter. <laughs> But, <laughs> but don't you think where are we going would be, like, the first thing you'd want to know? Depends how much you trust Crowan. <laughs> I don't know! I know him as my kind of cousin. He's, like, one of my favorite characters. But I'm getting really weird vibes from this. I don't get it. I'm like, what's happening? Okay, what is your vote? For how long is what my instincts say, but what it's your playthrough, so you're the one who makes the choice. <laughs> Just because, like uh -huh. I said, mm -hmm. if we assume Mary completely trusts Crowan, mm -hmm. the where wouldn't necessarily Matter. be as big of a worry of hers. Worry as opposed to Am I coming back? <laughs> so then should we go with coming back and for how long? I mean, both of those are essentially... The coming back puts a little more doubt on... Okay, I'll say for how long. A long time. I... I don't understand. What is this? Did... Did something bad happen? Also, he probably wouldn't have answered where. That's true. <laughs> Listen, I... I'll try to explain it all later, but for now, just I just 
need you to trust me and come with me. Uh, I feel like Mary trusts him. Don't you think? Mm -hmm. It's all up to you. It's a lot to ask right now. I trust you. I trust Crowin. <laughs> I don't think he'd do anything to hurt us. No. no, no I just no. want to know what's going on. I feel like that's a lot to ask right now. Is a bit more combative. It is very combative. Yeah. So I'll go with I trust you. Because I feel like Mary trusts Crowin wholeheartedly. I don't think there was ever a point in time, even in his bad ending, where she didn't trust him. I can't honestly remember what his bad ending was <laughs> he died didn't he go missing maybe maybe he left oh that's when twyla, twyla killed him she... no she didn't kill it she... didn't she light the house on no that was twyla's bad ending. oh what did twyla do she took him Oh, yes, 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 yes. And then he never came back. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, but even then, even in his bad ending, we never had a point in time where we didn't trust him. Right? Like, where we felt threatened. We were confused threatened. by the fact that he had a gun. <laughs> yeah. But it's not that we didn't trust him. We were just like, what? <laughs> What's happening right now? And that he shot Twyla. Yeah. And then she got up. <laughs> yeah. Um, Okay. I trust you. Thank you. I will explain it eventually. Okay, I want to know now. And also, where did this car come from? Did we always have this? Do we have a garage? No, Crowan doesn't have a car. They both take the bus everywhere. Is there someone in it? Crowan walked me over to the back door of the truck and opened it for me. He helped me inside, but frantically, as if to rush me. As I began to I buckle in, I noticed that... Huh? <laughs> I said, I'm pretty sure he doesn't have a car. But, yeah, I mean, this... If he did have a car, it'd be a, like the other ones. But. <laughs> <laughs> as I began to buckle in, I noticed that Crone and I weren't the only ones in the vehicle. Okay, see, that's what I was i was wondering. Well, I mean... He could have left it on. I could have sworn she said somebody was in the driver's seat. But oh, I don't maybe know. Maybe I'm misremembering. Yeah. I think that maybe you put the person there. Your brain was like, oh, it's on. Somebody's sitting in the driver's seat. As a responsible driver would. Don't leave your cars running. All right. <laughs> there was a man sitting in the driver's seat. <gasps> Is this... Batman? Do we? Are we in the Batmobile? You're peeking the mic. I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> it might not be him. Let's not get it. Calm down. Okay. It was so dark I couldn't see his face. Batman. Or is it our fault? Oh, <gasps> what of our dad's Batman? That'd be weird, cause. We're Damien. <laughs> oh, I hate that guy. <laughs> <laughs> he has a messed up childhood. I guess it's okay. <laughs> um, yeah, it was so dark I couldn't see his face. But Crohn seemed familiar enough with him as he climbed into the passenger seat. And we began to drive. <gasps> wow. I don't think it's my dad, because look at the no, hair. He's got like a Yu-Gi-Oh, like, zigzag spike thing. Yeah. <laughs> what is going on? I wanted to ask Crowan what was happening, but not in front of this stranger. Who, who was, who is this? Do I even try to ask? Well, it certainly took you long enough. Ho oh, ho ho! It's Batman. Sorry. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, I was trying to match the voice blips a bit. Yeah, I should fucking hope so. We wouldn't have... We wouldn't even be having to do this bullcrap if you weren't such an idiot. I'm sorry. 
I will try to do better the next time. Okay. Next time. So these two are like on the opposite ends. Peasant's <laughs> 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 throat is just like. Ah! <laughs> What's happening? Oh <laughs> so every time I have to switch, I'm like. Ah. <laughs> uh, what you want? You what? You want there to be a next time to all this? I'm sorry. I'm so. Who are you, mysterious man? That was a poor choice of words. Whatever. I don't want to get mad in front of Mary. Okay, already their relationship, doesn't it give you, like, boss and then, like, not goon, but you know what I mean? Like, sassy underling? Yeah, or something like Just that. Just because he's comfortable sassing him? I don't know, this is so weird. Who is this mysterious spiky-haired man? Well, he's not. Sp he's just got the one spike. The rest of it seems to go back. man. Let's see. Yeah. Ooh, it's just, uh... It's alright. As long as we continue like this, things should be fine. Uh, um... What are things, exactly? You know, I hope you're right about that. Don't ignore me! Because if we have to worry over this a second longer, it's gonna be your head. I'm aware. Okay, is Groen a mafia member? Mm -hmm. Or a gang member? But have I failed you before? Uh... Where are we going, if I can ask? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'd say you have. I think that's a bit of an exaggeration. We've gotten this far, haven't we? It isn't far enough. You think my dad would settle for this shit? <gasps> is he? Is this like Croen's the young, what is it, young master? <laughs> and now he's ascended? <laughs> In all fairness, your father was a lot more patient. I've read so many Yakuza manga. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, well, I'm not. Ugh, this is giving me a headache. Likewise. It's just, it's fine. It's fine. Okay. <laughs> Maybe when we get there, I can, like, sit down with some coffee or something. That sounds like a good idea. I just hope... It actually calms you and doesn't make you more jittery. Yeah, yeah, shut it. Oh, uh, we're gonna make it there. We're never gonna make it there at this rate, though. How do you mean? You kidding me? You drive like a fucking snail. You wanna go any faster, maybe? It's safer to drive like this. It's dark, and we hard, we've we hardly traveled this path before. Come on, it's straight. It's a straight fucking line. What are you worried about? Crashing to all these other cars around us right now? I'm so <laughs> confused. I'm entertained, but I'm so confused. Confused. Like what sarcastic we, crowing is hard to do. <laughs> what are we? Because his voice is high. <laughs> what are we running from? Because originally I thought the main concern was the butcher, which is Reginald, right? At least to a degree. I thought it was, but now I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. <laughs> I gave my reasoning. 
We'll get there regardless. Yeah, but it'll only be sunrise when we do. Fucking. Oh Give my me that! Go. Cry! <laughs> <laughs> this is it. This is going to end bad. We're going to crash. I feel it. Crone suddenly grasped the steering wheel, much to the shock and worry of both me and the driver. What the hell are you doing? Let me fucking drive. Stop the car and let me drive if you're not going to listen. <laughs> ah! Dear. Oh no! That can crunch your car pretty bad. Yeah. Growing up. What's happening? <laughs> I fuck it. This was going to happen. I knew it. I told you we shouldn't done this way. What do you expect to do then, huh? I... After them. With what? I don't care. You wear their head, right? Uh, not let it get away. What? Well, uh, Mary. You. She was breathing. Thing broken, right? So you take care of her. Ain't you used to that job by now? Batman? I... not sticking around. It's hard, because sometimes it was not broken, but... Yeah. <laughs> other times it was... Oh, this cut me off. Man! God damn it! Mary? Can you hear me? God? <laughs> Is that you? <laughs> Come on. Let's get you home safe. Back to the cabin? So many dots. So many dots. Okay. Mm. I'm in pain. But not a lot. Just very numb. Like being hit with a big wave on the beach. Slowly I could feel my senses coming back to me. I'm pressed against something. I'm... being held? But by who? <gasps> Open your eyes. Oh, we're gonna see what Batman looks like! <laughs> no, I didn't. I'm sorry. Okay, are you ready? This is important. This is a big reveal, Dustin. I've been building. Well, we still don't know for sure. This is Batman. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's Batman. Okay, here we go. Here we go. <gasps> uh, he has eyes like Crowen. He's missing one. Yeah. Wait! Is it my dad? No. My dad, dad had an eye patch, her, right? No. That was my Crowen's uncle? Crowen's dad has an eye patch. Oh. Well, he said my dad. Is this my uncle? Well, there is a third brother, remember? But they don't talk about him. Or no, he died. But Crowen's my kind of cousin. We're not blood related. So maybe his blood dad. Yeah, I'm so confused about all that. Maybe Crowen's... his dad and our dad look exactly. What the if same. this is my <laughs> uncle, Crowen's stepdad, and Crowen's actual dad is someone else? It was somehow involved in this. I don't know. I don't know. What? Is, I don't know. Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh hey, you're awake. Huh? <laughs> oh wait, that was you. Who, who are you? Oh, I guess it's not my. I guess it's not my uncle then. At I least mean... it's no one that Mary's met. Whoa, easy now. 
The man let me stand on my own two feet. I quickly backed away from him. Who? Who? who where? Mary, calm down. It's me, remember? No! From the car? With Crone? I was driving? Ah, oh, that's... <laughs> <Ta -da! laughs> I recognize Charming your smile. voice. <laughs> huh? Charming smile. Ding. That, that makes me feel a lot better. But, uh, may I ask what happened to Crowen? Oh, uh, well. It's gonna be a long story. <gasps> Walk with me. <gasps> Are we gonna get an explanation? So, first... Should we continue? Is this the end? Uh, Kendra, I said... I Kendra, it said that the true ending adds an extra hour. Oh. And the full... The play, one playthrough was supposed to be two hours, and it oh. took us a long time. Oh, okay, okay. I highly doubt... Okay, 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 okay. Go ahead. I said... Oh. Is he... What? I'm trying to remember, how tall is Reginald compared to Mary? Because I think he's a lot taller. I think he's taller, he would be... I don't know. I like this music, though. <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea what's going on anymore. For some reason, he seems like he's pretty tall. But then maybe I'm misremembering how tall Reginald is. I know Crowen's not much taller than Mary. How much do you remember? Oh, um, we, we were driving somewhere. Crone was mad at you. Crone was fighting with you. You guys were, were talking weird. Uh, Crone was mad at you? Or you guys were talking weird? I know. <laughs> I've got his legs! <laughs> um, I don't know. You guys were talk. I want to know what they were talking about, so that's why I kind of want to go with you guys are talking weird. But then I'm like, well, we're still playing as Mary, so I feel like Mary would be like, I was mad at you. <laughs> what do you think? What do you think? My first thought was Crone was fighting with you. Well, I guess he kind of was. Okay. I don't know. If you think Crone was mad at you, it would be better to go with that one. I don't know, because he wasn't exactly... I mean, he was mad at him, but he was more like mad at his driving. And then he wasn't exactly fighting with him. He was fighting for the wheel, which is dumb. Don't do that. You click whichever one you think. Ah, I don't want to make a mistake! There are no mistakes! Okay, okay. <laughs> there are no longer... <laughs> Crowen was mad at you. Ah, uh, he certainly was. Though, he almost always is. So it's not like this time it was any different. Then Crowen got really mad. And wanted to drive the car himself. And we hit something? Or swerved? It's a bit foggy. You're walking fine. You're not in any pain, are you? Uh, we said we kind of were, but I don't know if it was exactly pain or grogginess. Or the, the... Coming out of, like, unconsciousness. Right. <laughs> I think it's I'm okay. Not sleep. <laughs> I feel a little numb. You were in the back of the car, which wasn't really damaged. I think you might have hit your head, though. That makes sense. You uh, do a concussion test on here. <laughs> <laughs> what year is it? <laughs> Follow the light. Um, I guess that's why I blacked out. Even though it wasn't too much damage, the car is no longer in any shape to drive us anywhere. 
And we can't exactly turn back now. Why? Is someone at the house? Well, if in this true ending everything was running somewhat concurrently Mm -hmm. between the three different endings, Mm -hmm. or routes, I guess, Mm -hmm. that would mean Twyla was starting to investigate Crowen. I guess... Is that why we would run away, though? Because of Twyla? Don't you? Hmm. In addition to her, you know, investigation of Reginald. Yeah. Okay. You know, on the bad end. Yeah, 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 yeah. So our only choice is to keep walking until we can get to the next town. I wasn't sure when you were going to wake up. But you were out for a while, so I admit I was getting pretty worried. But I did wake up for a little bit. When Crowan and you were yelling at each other, I heard Crowan say some things. Letting someone get away? Is is he okay? What happened to him? Ah, oh, well. I suppose there's no use hiding it now. I mean, how much do you know about it? I feel like I know a lot, but yet I know nothing. <laughs> know about what? I I don't know anything about any of this. Roman just woke me up and told me we had to go. I see. I guess I'll be the one explaining it then. As best I can, anyways. <laughs> if you don't know anything about it... I guess I'll start from the beginning. Or at least my understanding of it. So, you know Hall City, right? Yeah. Yes. It's where my aunt and uncle lived for most of my life. And where my parents lived before they had me. That's right. Well, uh. Mafia, mafia, mafia. How do I say this? Mafia, 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 mafia! Picture this with me, will you? Mafia, mafia, mafia. Ah! <laughs> I can win! Woo! Mob, gang, criminal association, whichever words you please you. Mafia! There were two of them centered in Holland City. The first we're we'll refer to as the Congress. They don't get anything done, <laughs> get anything done is that what you said? <laughs> <laughs> the second we'll refer to as the Parliament. They also don't get anything Nothing done. Nothing gets done in this way. <laughs> If you're American, you know what's up. <laughs> we don't have a parliament. Oh, dang it, never mind. <laughs> Wait. Br- Britain's parliament also is notoriously bad at getting things done. And Canada's. But none of them look like... <laughs> I don't know much about Australia. Sorry, Australia. <laughs> so we do have a viewer from Australia. Twitch told me so. Um, okay, but none of these so look like Congress my parents. Congress and... Department. And none of these look like my parents, though. What if we're like the the good guys? Okay, I, I'm, I'm my brain's getting too far ahead. Okay. <clears throat> Holland City housed these two organizations, but it hardly had room for both. The two groups were always at war with one another. Fighting over territory, money, whatever they could. I'm trying to decide which group I like best. That's and you don't even know anything about them yet! Yeah, but this one, the dude has a cool outline, but this one I like the chick's outline better. (laughs) (laughs) What if they're like terrible people? I mean, they're 
law. Right. Cri they're criminals. Yes. But I'm just saying by aesthetics wise. Uh, <laughs> they may be bad I can't guys. Pick but which damn, one they look good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure which one I think looks cooler. <laughs> Uh, okay. I think I'll go with the Congress because I like the hats better. <laughs> I like that they both have hats. Well, of course, they're criminals. They have to have like fedoras or holders or <laughs> some sort of hat. <laughs> Even if it's just to make it so that the other group couldn't have it. I tell you this because. Because. Your <gasps> uncle. <laughs> he was the head of the Congress. Cool. Okay, so I picked at least our uncle's side. Is this going to be uh... <gasps> family against family? I or... was going to say like a Romeo Juliet West Side Story. Oh, like Crohn's mom was of the other group or something? Well, Crone's mom's like some actress, apparently. <laughs> you know, that's fitting for a mafia. <laughs> <laughs> or a model, I can't remember yeah. what she said. <laughs> One of the two. <laughs> you're, you're joking. You can't be serious. Uncle Cross was such a sweet man. He was. I met him in the afterlife that one time, and he was very nice. You come to me on the day of my... <laughs> <laughs> he wouldn't hurt a fly. Haven't you ever questioned why he wore that eye patch? I just figured, you know, like the war. Yeah, he did say the war. Yeah. But <laughs> what if it's a uh, gang war? Oh, I didn't even think about that. It's one of those things, you know, someone's like, oh, I lost it. And what? The war. And you just go, oh, okay. Thank you for your service. <laughs> you know, like, you don't question it. Um, It was from his time in the army. That's what I said. He was. In a war. Oh. I. I see. Oh, I think yours was correct. Please continue. Eventually, the Congress had overpowered the Parliament. And the Parliament was pushed to Blackwood. Oh. The Congress had now had full control of Holland City and weren't worried about the parliament interfering with their plans anymore. I wish I could say that's where the story ended. But... But if it was, we wouldn't be here right now. <gasps> Your mother, Mary. My mom? What about her? Your mother was a good friend of Cross. Long time friends. I believe they'd known each other from back when your mother was still a child. Yes, I knew that. That's why I started calling him my uncle to begin with. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> so then he is Cron's dad. We're we're just not blood related, right? Though our I thought dad our dad was his brother. A lot like him. <laughs> Maybe it's brother like in the mafia sense. Uh, well, like I said, we'll just let's continue and see what's going on here. <laughs> then again, this dude we're with also looks a lot yeah. like <laughs> Maybe it's just like a uniform. <laughs> like Nurse Joy. <laughs> um because he was such a good friend of mom's. Did mom know was mom involved? Did mom know? I feel like you shouldn't accuse right away. Did mom know? Please tell me. Yes, she knew. And your father knew too. But they were never involved in any of it. Cool. <laughs> until recently. Is that when we should? I mean... Yeah. Cliffhangers! <laughs> That's what we're gonna say for today. What a cute picture. Did our parents take over for our uncle now that he's dead? No, I'm guessing that. Oh, maybe. <laughs> I was gonna say somebody came after my parents to get, like, revenge on him because didn't they go missing first? 
didn't go. My parents went missing, and then Crowan and his parents, uh, Crowan's parents died. I don't remember. I don't remember the order. Dang. Oh, what if my mom turned them in? No, because they were murdered. The police don't do that. <laughs> anyway, I don't know. This is getting fun. Um, anyway, that is the end for today's stream. Sorry with the whole technical difficulties. Everything was weird, but it's cool. I don't know how much we have left, but I am so happy we're finally getting an explanation to so many things. But I know this is making me and Vera like, oh, what's that prequel like? Yeah, <laughs> I'm excited. I'm so excited. Uh, I can't wait till next Friday. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this series. Um, if you are, come back next Friday. Watch us continue this. If you like watching Justin and I stream, you can check us out Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and sometimes Sunday nights. Um, <coughs> you can also check out our YouTube channel. We play other games over there that we don't stream. And we also have a TikTok where I post funny clips or stupid things. You know, just short videos if you want to check that out. Um, but yeah, please like, comment, subscribe, follow, whatever you feel like doing. We will appreciate it. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.